the war to come back. Oh, hello. It's really cold outside today. Come and look. Doesn't the world look different on cold days like this? Yes! Look! <laughs> Yippee! Water, then get back to my cosy basket. Huh? That's not water. It's just a big white lump. Oh, it's so cold it sort of hurts to touch it. Oh, your water's turned into something else, Jess. I know. When will the water come back? <gasps> hey! That's the big question! Who? Ask a lot of what? Ask a lot of Where? Ask a lot of Why? Ask a lot of Ask it, test it, find a way! Yes, with Jess, come on, let's play! What's the question here today? When will the water come back? <laughs> I'm really thirsty! <gasps> let's try the farmyard tap! I can get water there! What's happened to it? <gasps> tink, 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 tink. <laughs> That's a great tune you're playing on that icicle, Jess. Icicle? Yep. The drips of water that came out of the tap froze because it's such a cold day. And when water freezes, you get ice. Uh -huh. And this long spiky thing is an icicle? Wow! So the water's frozen. Hmm. It's too cold for me. I'm off to find some mud to bury myself in and keep warm. Bye. Bye, Horace. <gasps> Oopsie. Uh-oh. Never mind. We need to find out when the water will come back so we can answer the big question. And I'm getting thirsty. Maybe someone else has got some water you can drink. Great idea. I know someone who's always got loads of water in a big drinking trough. Do you know who she is? She lives in a stable, she wears a hat and she has a lovely long mane. Is it Billy, Mimi or Willow? Willow, yes, well done. Let's go and see Willow. Come on. <laughs> wow. Look at all the icicles. That's amazing! <laughs> no, she's not here! Whoa! Look! <gasps> More ice! Willow's water's frozen too! Puppy coming through! Whee! Whee! Oh. <laughs> hey! This puddle's all slippy and icy! <laughs> Let me try. Whoa! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Ice isn't just white and cold, it's slippy and hard too. <laughs> Whoa! That sliding's made me even more thirsty. When will the water come back? There must be some water somewhere else on the farm. Where do you think we should try? Buttercup Meadow, Horace's Pond, or Mimi's Hutch? Horace's Pond! Yes! There's loads of water there. Come on, let's go! <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe it! 
Even the pond's gone icy. What? No way! Poor Horace. How can he go swimming with no water? We have to find out when the water will come back. And now I'm thirsty. <gasps> Jenks! Our water bowls! There's always water in them. Come on, Jess. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if the puppy's bowls will be icy too. What do you think? Oh. Ice! Were you right? I'll never get a drink if all the water's gone icy. Hello, Jess. Willow! Can you help answer the big question? We were all really thirsty and the water everywhere has turned to ice and we're all really hot and we don't know what to do. <laughs> Why don't you lick the ice? Lick the ice? Are you sure? Uh-huh. You shouldn't lick just any old ice. But this ice used to be Joey and Jinx's water. <laughs> so? So it's fine. And I'm sure it'll cool you down. Bye. Bye, Bye. It's really nice and cold. Look, the sun's coming out. Finished. Oh, sorry, Jess. We haven't left any for you. It's okay. My bowl at the barn's full of ice. I can lick that. I want the ice. It's gone. And the water's back. Hmm. What's changed? I know. The sun's come out. It must be because of the sun. Hello, you three. Still trying to cool down? Willow, it's amazing. First our water disappeared. And ice came instead. Yes. The water froze into ice. And now when it's warm again, and the ice would be really nice to have. It's disappeared and the water's back. <laughs> That's right. You've discovered how ice melts back into water. Melting? Woohoo! So the water freezes into ice when it's cold. Yes. And now that the weather's warm again, it's melted back into water. We've done it! We've found out about freezing and melting. And we've answered the question. Yippity yay, yippity yay, yippity yay! Hooray! Hey, hey, yippity yay! We found the answer with Jess today. We followed the clues, we put it to the test. We tried our best and then we guessed. Sing it! Hey, hey, yippity yay! Here's the answer. Shout hooray! The water came back when the sun came out and melted the ice. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> hey Jess, this is as much fun as sliding. Come on! <laughs> I will when I've had a drink. <laughs> the next time it's freezing, why don't you have fun finding some icicles? It's brilliant. Come and help me answer another question soon. Bye! <laughs> How can I go faster than Joey and Jinx? <laughs> Catch me. Oh, hello. We're playing in the snow. <laughs> Whoa! I love snow, don't you? Hey, Jess, we're going to play on Cherry Hill. Are you coming too? Oh, yes. Let's go. Of, but it covers up the grass and I'm hungry. <laughs> You're always hungry, Ba. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's race down the hill. Brilliant. I love racing down Cherry Hill <laughs> and I'm really fast. Line up, everyone. 
<laughs> I'll start us off. Get ready. Go. <laughs> 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 Disaster. Oh, Bah, that was fun! Oh. Running didn't work. There must be another way. Um, let me think. How can I go faster than Joey and Jinx down the snowy hill? <laughs> hey, that's the big question. <laughs> Ask a lot of what? Ask a lot of Where? Ask a lot of Why? Ask a lot of Ask it. I go faster than Joey and Jinx down the snowy hill. Joey and Jinx didn't run, did they? They rolled. That's it. I bet I'll go much faster if I roll. Joey, Jinx, ready for another race? Yeah, coming. <laughs> Faster than the puppies. <laughs> Stop, Jess! I'm getting wet. Go and shake yourself over Horace. He likes getting wet. Yes, Horace. Maybe he'll know how to get down the hill fast. Where will we find Horace? In my barn, in Mimi's hutch, or at the pond? The pond! Yes, thanks! Yay! Let's go! <laughs> That's my friend Horace! <laughs> Slide, Horace. Yeah, and it's a lot easier than jumping. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> wow, you've just given me an idea. I have? Yes, I'm going to slide down Cherry Hill. Um, why? Because I really want to go faster than Joey and Jinx down the snowy hill. Sounds fun. Hi, Jess. Hi, Horace. Mimi. Watch this. Whee! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Hello. I brought you some snowdrops, Horace. They'll look so pretty round your pond. Whoa! Thanks, Mimi. Do you want to come with me, Mimi? I'm racing the puppies in the snow. Oh, where? Do you remember where we're racing? On Cherry Hill, in the Whispering Woods, or in the farmyard. On Cherry Hill, yes, you're right. Oh, I'd love to come to Cherry Hill. Great, come on. Bye, Horace. See you, Jess. Woohoo! Nearly. I just need to test something out. We'll help, Jess. Thanks. Do you want to help us with our snow puppy, Mimi? Yes, please. Right. Let's try out the sliding. All I have to do is sit down like Horace did. 
and whee! Oh, hmm. I know. He pushed himself off. Okay, here goes. Whee! Hmm. Oh no, it isn't working. Oh. If I can't move on my own, maybe I could sit on something that does move. Like the trolley. Mimi, can you bring the trolley up here, please? Ready, Jess? And go! Whee! <laughs> oh, it's stopping! Huh? Oh, it stopped. Now what's wrong? Hmm, I thought so. What? The wheels sink into the snow and get stuck. We need something smooth like Horace's slide. Hmm, yes. Smooth like the trolley. What if we take all the wheels off? <gasps> then the bottom of the trolley would be smooth. Brilliant idea, Jess. Then you can use it to slide on top of the snow. Exactly, Billy. Come on, we've got work to do. Ready to go, Jess? I'm ready. I'm ready. Hooray! Let's race. Do you think I'm going to win this time? <laughs> ready! We found the answer! Yippity yay! Yippity yay! Yippity yay! than Joey and Jinx down the snowy hill by sliding down on something smooth. Whee! <laughs> hey, wait for me. Why don't you try sliding the next time it snows? It's brilliant fun. Come and help me answer another question soon. Bye. <laughs> We help Billy stay warm. Oh, oh, oh so close! Hello, we're playing flying fur cones. You have to try and kick a fur cone into that bucket. You'll go, Bar. Okay, but I don't think I'm going to be any good at this game. You'll be great, Bar. Yes, you're Bar the Woolly Wonder. <laughs> Woolly wonder, woolly wonder, woolly wonder, woolly wonder. Yeah! <laughs> and now it's brilliant Billy, the flying fur cone champion. <laughs> brilliant Billy, brilliant Billy, brilliant Billy, brilliant Billy. It's cold. Just stay in Bar's hat today. <gasps> hat? I promised to glue some flowers to Willow's hat. I'd better go. See you later. Bye, Mimi. <laughs> I can't play if I'm in Bar's hat. Oh, poor Billy. How can Billy stay warm enough to play flying fur cones? Hey, that's the big question. <laughs> Ask a lot of what? Ask a lot of Ask a lot of wow. Ask a lot of Ask it, test it, find a way Guess with Jess, come on let's play What's the question here today? How can Billy stay warm enough to play flying fur cones? 
I don't know. I'm never cold. I'm toasty warm all the time. <laughs> so you are, Bar. Why do you think Bar's always warm? Is it because he's covered in leaves, straw or wool? Bar's covered in wool. Yes, he's the woolly wonder. So if I had some of Bar's wool, I'd be warm too. Yes. But my wool stuck to me. How can Billy have any? You're always leaving bits of wool on fences and trees, Bar. <laughs> Good thinking, Billy. If we can find some of those bits, maybe we can use them to keep you warm. Come on. Found some. Oh! <laughs> Brilliant. Yay! Hurry, Jess. It's cold. OK, let me just stick it on you. It didn't stick. <laughs> I'm freezing again. We need something sticky. Hmm. Mimi was going to glue some flowers in Willow's hat. <gasps> She'll have some sticky glue. Let's go and ask her. Come on. <laughs> there. Wow, you look lovely, Willow. <laughs> really? Do you think so? You're really good at gluing, Mimi. <laughs> Thanks, Jess. Could you glue this wool on Billy? We need to keep her warm. So I can play flying vacuums? Uh, not really, Jess. If I glued wool to Billy, it might never come off. <gasps> you mean not ever? That's right. Oh. Oh, everyone's either covered in wool or thick fur except me. I'm not covered in wool or fur. It's this lovely blanket Mimi made me that keeps me warm when it's chilly outside. Hmm, a blanket. <gasps> That's what we need to keep you warm, Billy. But where will we find one? That's easy. I've got a tiny bit left over from when I was making Willow's blanket. Here it is. Thanks, Mimi. <laughs> You've stopped shivering. Oh, you're right. I'm warm. Let's play flying fur cones again. Three of these fur cones going straight in that bucket. <laughs> Watch. Brilliant Billy. Brilliant Billy. Brilliant Billy. <laughs> It's no good at all. Are you all right, Billy? Yes, but I'm still cold. <laughs> Just a minute. Bar's wool isn't the only thing he wears to keep warm. What else does Bar wear to keep warm? Is it a coat, a pair of boots, or a hat and scarf? A hat and scarf. Yes. My scarf! Yes, that's what you need, Billy. A woolly scarf. Hey! You can have mine as I've got all this wool. I won't miss <laughs> it. <laughs> but it's much too big. Hmm. Where can we find a smaller scarf for Billy? <gasps> I know, Mimi. She had a smaller blanket. Maybe she has a smaller scarf. Let's go and see. Under, over, under. What are you doing? I'm plaiting Willow's tail. <laughs> and doesn't it look lovely? Over, me. Do you have a small over, woolly scarf for Billy? Under. No, but I could make one out of this little piece of bar's wool. <gasps> Can you do that? Oh yes, but I have to turn it into woolen yarn first. You have to pull it and twist it like this. Pull, twist, pull, twist. See? Yarn. It's 
still doesn't look like my scarf. Not yet, Mark. But the thing is, your scarf is made of yarn. Yes! Lots of bits of yarn all sort of threaded together. Over, under, over, under. That's called knitting. You use the yarn and knitting needles to go over and under and make all sorts of woolly things. Mimi, can you knit a scarf for Billy? Of course I can, Jess. Now, all I need are my knitting needles. There! Finished! It's perfect! Try it on, Billy. Oh, it's so warm! Thanks, Mimi! I'm ready to play Flying Virgos! Brilliant, Billy! Brilliant, Billy! Brilliant, Billy! by wearing a scarf made from Bar's wool. Why don't you play a game of flying fur cones too? And if it's cold outside, make sure you wrap up in a nice, warm, woolly scarf. Come and help me answer another question soon. Bye-bye. Here goes. <laughs>